You know what's so funny? Dudeism. Have you? Dudeism oh, is a oh. is a religion now. Yeah. Yeah. Dudeism, and you know what? I was raised Catholic. I'd switch to dudeism. <laughs> yeah. I think it makes more sense to oh, me. Man. I just visited the Pope, and I would talk him into doing dudeism. <laughs> Tell me more of this dude. He did have a white Russian. Though, he did have he? a white Russian, and he was saying, there's a lot of, you know, I got to get the rug back. So, <laughs> it, ties the, it ties the Vatican together. It ties the Vatican together. It's one rug. My, uh, but Judaism, is a, it's a religion. The uh, Lebowski just keeps, you know, and there's the, the fest that goes on for three days, yep. and it's... Uh, religion and there's a book, you know, uh, what is it? The, the something book of like, the dude? No, or? no, they have many books. One book is uh, written in shake, like Shakespeare would uh-huh. do it. You know, uh-huh. two two dudes in Verona. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sitting, I'm sitting at this at this dinner party, and on my right is Ram Das. You know, the guy sure, who yeah, would be yeah. here now, and this guy over here is a guy named Bernie Glassman, mm-hmm. and he's a Zen master. And he leans over to me and says, I'm really Doug uh, Lebowski. Say, oh, great. He says, it's full of koans, you know. I say, koans? What do you mean? You know, and you know what a koan is? It's like, well, it's like, what is the sound of one hand clapping? Uh, you know, yeah, these yeah, kinds yeah. of zen. These kind of weird. Yeah, yeah, zen, zen riddles are. Yeah, that make you, you think. Know, there's no uh, logical uh, answer to it. And I, he says, the film's full of koans. I said, what are you talking about? He says, well, who wrote and directed the film? The Koan Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> and he says, he says, I'm all He's about... He's a wise ass, is what he, he says, is. I'm all about bringing uh, Buddhism uh, and Zen to modern times. He says, let's write a book uh, about Lebowski. And I said, what, what do you mean? He says, well, the dude abides. Very Buddhistic. Right? Yes, yeah. Uh, I said, what are some other koans? Uh, Shut the fuck up, Donnie. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's a koan? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Or, Shut or, the fuck up, Donnie. Yeah, yeah exactly. You know, or uh, uh, well, that's just like your opinion, man. Yeah, yeah. So we go up to Montana and write for two weeks We when we wrote a book, The Dude and the Zen Master, another blooming thing out of this movie. You know, it just keeps it, just, it keeps giving. You know what's interesting to me is when that movie came out, it was not a success. It was not deemed a success. And uh but like the best things, it resonates and then it grows and it grows and it grows and it grows and it's gonna keep on growing. And I think, you know, like a thousand years from now, there will be <laughs> giant yeah. dudism centers <laughs> yes. that people go to. Well, those brothers, the koan. Brothers, <laughs> yeah. I mean, they're you know, just masters, and you know, they make it look like it's like it's nothing. But you know, they are the two guys. I'm pretty. I think I've met everybody. I uh, revere the Cohen brothers. Love them. I'm obsessed with them. Never met them, and I saw them once in a restaurant, mm-hmm. and I was sitting very nearby. And I didn't say oh, a word. And you wish you did. Well, I kind of was. I, I, I'm. That's how high up they are oh, for me. Which is so like, gr- I yeah, do not. Yeah. I would not. Uh, you know, just to to meet them would would make my year. They're intimidating. Uh, don't you yeah, think? yeah, I think so. Yeah, uh, and I and I have such. They they are they really are my go to filmmakers, and I've I've watched all of their films m- so I many times. That, yeah, you can see them over and over, and just a- appreciate the mastery. I mean, with Lebowski, you know, if something comes on a, that I'm in on TV, I'll mm-hmm. you know click watch a scene, click. But with Lebowski, I you know I'll say I'll just watch you know till you know Donnie dies and or something like that and it'll keep I, I get hooked because it's like uh, I love you popcorn. watching Lebowski oh, I love you at home oh man watching Lebowski and uh, it's like a black hole folding oh, in on itself I know exactly yeah. in a good way it's the snake eating its oh, tail yeah, it's oh, the snake man. birthing its tail it birthing yeah. it very nice talk um, about a home movie man I mean yeah. that is very much a home movie I just you know one of my favorite parts about that movie is is when you Whenever you have a chance to get your favorite drink, <laughs> you will, as people do that like their drink, they'll kill time just so they can drink more. I always get the sense, you're always saying like, yeah, a lot, a lot of angles, a lot of angles, a lot of levels. 
God, and you're bullshitting. You're totally, <laughs> it's, and I know I've done that in my life when I just, I'm like, I got a nice glass of wine here. Man. My wife thinks maybe we should, let's move on. Let's pay the check. And I'm like, you know, we got, we got a lot to talk about here. A lot of angles, a lot of moves. Uh, I just want to have just, a, just everyone settle down for a second. Um, Turturro, I, Turturro made that movie, you know, an, yeah. uh, another outshoot of uh, Lebowski. What's the name of it, you know? Oh, where he plays his yeah, character. Yeah, he plays oh, yeah. the pedophile. Yeah, you know, his, yeah. You know, yeah, I the role everyone's after. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I turned it down six times. 